Hi, I'm Elizabeth. I go by Honest Liz on the internet. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. Remember to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any new posts. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to avoid overloading your curls with hair gel. And while we are on the subject, I'm going to tell you about my favorite gels and how they are different from each other and how they have different hold and maybe you can see which gel will work for you that way so we're going to talk about strong hold gel medium hold gel light hold gel and also budget gels that don't break the bank Tired of crunchy, weighed down curls from too much gel? Let me show you how to get juicy, bouncy definition without the overload. First tip, emulsify your gel. Don't apply it straight from the bottle. Rub it between your palms until it's thin and glossy. This way, the gel spreads evenly without clumping. Always apply a lightweight leave-in conditioner first. If you have thick, coarse hair, dry hair like mine, you can even substitute the leave-in conditioner with a nice, rich curl cream. This keeps your curls hydrated and prevents the gel from getting crunchy. So if you have really hard, crunchy curls, after using hair gels, you can soften it by using something hydrating before you apply the gel. For extra definition without crunch, try finger coiling. You'll use less gel, but still get amazing definition. I prefer finger coiling with a soft hold cream. So I end up using less gel than necessary, therefore avoiding overloading my curls with hair gel. Instead of adding more gel on day two or day three, you can Rehydrate your curls just with plain water. Gels are water soluble, especially if you're using curly hair safe hair gels. They reactivate with just a little bit of water. Once your curls are dry, scrunch out the crunch to reveal soft, bouncy curls. Don't do it while wet. Don't even separate your curl clumps while it's wet. It disrupts the gel cast. So if you want a gel cast, make sure your hair is thoroughly dry and soften your curls by scrunching out the crunch at the end. Now that you know how to avoid overloading your curls with gel, let me share my current favorite gels. Light, medium, strong and budget friendly options so you can choose what works best for your hair routine. First up, light hold gels. These are perfect when I want volume and a natural soft look. The Bounce Curl Light Hold Cream Gel. This gel gives me that soft hold with beautiful definition but still keeps my curls lightweight and bouncy. It's ideal for days when I want my hair to look gritty and my curls need to be tighter and as natural as possible. Mirable Natural Silky Smooth Flaxseed Gel. This is another favorite light hold gel for me. It gives a smooth finish without any crunch and it's packed with natural ingredients that makes my hair feel super healthy and softens my coarse curly hair. Since these gels offer a light hold, I prefer using them for midweek styling. So I use them for my wash and goes when I know that I'm going to be styling my hair more often in the week. Next are my medium hold gels which are perfect for lasting definition with a little bit more hold. The Maintains Volume Gel gives me up to 3 days of great definition and also volume. Plus it adds that extra shine that I love. This is my go-to gel for curls that stay defined for days. The hold is firm enough to keep uh, the frizzies away for a few days. 
and it doesn't weigh my curls down when I use the right amounts. With these, I don't really need to refresh my curls midweek, so they are perfect to use when I am short on time. When I need my curls to last for days with zero frizz, I reach for these Stronghold Gels. The Buklem Stronghold Gel is perfect for locking my curls in that curl pattern. It defines them to the core. So if I'm traveling or if I'm going to be outside in the sun, in humidity, in the heat, or know that I won't have time to wash my hair, this is what I rely on. The Only Curls Mega Hold Gel. This one gives me long lasting definition without feeling stiff. It's great for those busy weeks when I need my curls and my grays to stay intact without having to worry about styling every day. I love these gels for special events or when I'm traveling or when I'm out in the humidity or sun or on the beach. They keep my curls frizz free and defined for up to a week. For budget friendly options, these gels are amazing. They give me strong hold without breaking the bank. I've been using this gel for over eight years now. It has a bit of a learning curve, but once you get the hang of it, it's a go-to for stronghold without any weird product reactions. Plus it's super affordable. This is a recent discovery. Although it looks like it's made for men, it's free of silicones and alcohol, and it's great for taming those flyaways and baby hairs. It even works on my grays without drying them out. A little goes a long way with these gels. If you're looking for firm hold curls at an affordable price, then these are the ones to go. If you want to learn more about my top product picks for your curls in 20 other categories and how to use them effectively, grab my curly hair products guide. It's packed with everything you need to know about finding the best products for your curls. The link is in the description below. That's it for today and I'll see you next Sunday.